what's going on guys Gil here again I'm back yes it's time for a shave I just came out the shower and I'm feeling good I'm off tomorrow so I get to indulge and shave tonight it's been crazy it's been crazy here like I said in my other video family and the kids and just don't find time you know for yourself so tonight it's for me guys so what are we shaving with tonight? Ooh, look at this baby. So this is the um, the Slim Adjustable that I found on the flea market on Sunday. I cleaned it up. Um, I found a date code on it. It's a L3, so I believe it's 1966, third quarter Gillette Slim. And man, this baby polished up nice. Really, really, really nice condition. Great condition, very clean, has all its plating on it. And for me, when I shave with my fat boy, number five is the magic number. So we're gonna go with number five again on this one. And I have a Gillette Wilkinson sword blade we're gonna throw in to the mix tonight. So I'll pop that in, nice and tight. I'll warm that up in some water. Tonight's brush is my John Freaks Custom Silver Tip Badger. I've had that soaking while I was in the shower. And I just got a beautiful piff today from Vincenzo. And he sent me Barrister and Man Night Music. I don't have a Barrister and Man soak. This is my first one. So I'm super excited to use it. And along with that, he sent me this beautiful, I mean, beautiful red and green shaving bowl. I had an accident with my shaving bowl. Like I said before, my mom is staying with us and some way, somehow, she knocked over my shaving bowl. So I mentioned that in the video and he was gracious enough to send me this bowl over. It's beautiful. I love the coloration on the bowl. I love the dimples it has on the inside. Perfect size for my hand. Matter of fact, I'll throw a little atom block to get a nice grip. So I have some soap in there already. And this soap smells really good. It's naturally brown like that. Um, I've seen some reviews on it. So I know when the lab is up, it has a creamy sort of caramel color. Um, smells of musk and vanilla. It has something else in there. I can't make it out though. I'm always the worst when it comes to scent profiles. There's a lot of guys out there that have a great nose and description, so we'll leave that up to them. But I'll give you my impression. And man, this stuff is whipping up nice. Oh man, it smells so good. It smells really nice. It has a sort of like a different smell. but it's definitely whipping up nice. Perfect, look at that. Ooh, can't wait, can't wait. Nice. So I hope everyone's been enjoying their summer so far. I know I have been pretty much at the lake I think I'm about five shades darker than I normally am. Um, so, got to work this weekend though. I'm only off on Sunday. So we'll see what we do. As far as going to the lake or the pool or figure out what we're going to do. But man, this soap right here is lathering up really, really nice. A couple of seconds in. And what I have so far so I've heard a lot of good things about Barrister and man and I tell you this it's not letting me down I think I'm good for today I think I have enough what do you think <laughs> all right so gonna get this on the face and get this shade going I shaved once before off camera, didn't have time to put it on camera, but I shaved once with the Slim Adjustable, and let me tell you man, 
That razor is a beauty. Something about those O'Gillettes. Man, they just, they shave like nobody's business. Five, for me, seems to be the magic number. And I always do two passes, so I go with the grain, cross grain. And then if I have anything left over, I'll clean up at the end. Oh, got a little hair there. So, but so far, I'm really looking forward to this shave. Smells really nice. All right, so clean off the hands. Oh, let me just get a little more right here. And we'll get the shave going. First pass. Barrister and man. See how it goes. Feels nice. Nice and smooth. Man. For, if there's any new guys out there, if there's one razor, in my opinion, you should get, it's a vintage Gillette adjustable. When it, my fat boy, the slim, the black beauties I have back there, none of those have let me down. Some of the best shades I've gotten has been with those old vintage Gillettes. Can't go wrong, can't go wrong. And I think I picked this up, if I remember correctly, for seven bucks. All I had to do was clean it up, sanitize it, a little flitz polish, honestly 30 minutes, and this baby was ready to go. Really nice slickness to this soap, and it smells amazing. Man, I'm always so impressed when I today with these Gillettes. First pass, clean. Nice, just nice, smooth, great shave. And what I liked about the slim, the head is slightly slimmer than the fat boy. So it's really good to get right up into that bridge right underneath the nose nice slim handle but it still has good weight to it so man it's just a good night a really good night So we're going to go for a second pass here. I'm going to go cross grain.
Nice. Very clean. Two passes. Smooth. Feels good. Now we're gonna throw on a little aftershave. So for tonight's aftershave, we're gonna be using some Gillette Cool Wave. I've had this stuff forever. Um, when I first started shaving, many, many moons ago, this is what I used to use. So I thought it'd be a cool little throwback to take it back to how I first started. So has alcohol, feels good, no irritation. nice really nice shave really nice really nice smells good I'm gonna throw on a little post shave always have to have my Nivea that right there guys is a classic shave in my opinion I just want to thank you again Vincenzo very generous of you I'm really enjoying the bowl the soap I appreciate it. I hope you guys enjoy the shave. I know I did. Thank you for your support, likes, subscriptions. I appreciate it. Thank you guys, and I'll see you on the next shave.